Hello everyone, my name is Jason with 3D BioCAD and I'm with Harry. So we're gonna talk about the full guideline for the customer who would like to jump into the milling side for the first time. So I'm a beginner in a milling machine mm -hmm. and I wanna know what's the difference between dry milling machine and wet milling machine. Okay, so it totally depends on what kind of material that you're going to mill. Mm -hmm. so, for example, if you like to mill in Emax, mm -hmm. then my recommendation would be 42W. Mm -hmm. But if you're focusing zirconia side, then 52D will be my recommendation. I see. Because Emax or glass ceramic mm -hmm. is considered as really strong material. Mm -hmm. That's why we have to use coolant with 42W mm -hmm. and cool the machines down during the milling. But zirconia before sintering, then it's kind of soft material. Mm -hmm. That's why we can easily make the crown without using coolant. So if you're a doctor mm -hmm. who's pushing for same day dentistry, then your choice should be 42W. And if you like to do any like more than three unit bridge or all than four in the end, mm -hmm. then you can always add 52D later on. I see. So as a beginner, I want to start with small cases, something like a single crown or three bridges. But later on, when I'm more skilled and get used to it, I want to try on the bigger case, something like a all X. On this situation, which one do you recommend to me? So, um, building single crown or up to three unit bridge, 52D or 52DCI in a fleet handle it. But like big case, all on X, then my recommendation of the would be 53DC since the minimum milling time for the full arch typically five to six hours at least and during that time it gives a lot of pressure especially on spindle and the collets yeah. and then later on you will meet an issue 52d that's why 3d biocad currently recommending 53dc for customer who mainly do all the next cases uh, i see I have no idea about each milling machine's capacity, so depends on how many cases am I handling all, which one do you recommend for me? Well, if you mill less than 50 cases per day, mm -hmm. then 52D enoughly handle your cases. But if it's over 70 to 80 mm -hmm. cases per day, then I would recommend customer to spend $10,000 more mm -hmm. and get 52DCI for better production. And if you have a lot of cases for all on X mm -hmm. or full arch restoration, then I recommend 53DC definitely because Roland recently completely renewed the spindle and collet area. So they made twice faster mm -hmm. milling speed compared to 52D and DCI. I see. So how much budget should I expect to get all the equipment for a whole process of milling. So, um, except purchasing machines, there is several things you have to prepare mm -hmm. on the top of the machine cost. So it's about $15,000. You have to think about the cam software mm -hmm. and the vacuum and the sintering oven as well. Mm -hmm. If you check the machines from other company, the median price point is about $40,000. And sometimes it go up 100k wow. so if you check like the dental industry like dental lab and milling center mm -hmm. they love Roland and their average price point is about forty thousand mm -hmm. dollar maximum and you will never find similar quality of product in this price range why should I mill in-house instead of outsourcing mm, I can explain that with Three simple reasons. First, you can minimize your turnaround time for mm -hmm. your cases, and you can extremely lower your manufacturing cost. Mm -hmm. And most important thing is you can assure the quality for your own cases. Mm. I see. I still have so many questions left. Uh, what should I do? Where should I contact? 
So whenever you have a question, you can always contact 3D BioCAD sales team mm -hmm. or support. So we will share our experience and we know their pain. Mm -hmm. And we have a solution can provide and maximize customer's business. Please contact 3D BioCAD. We are here to help.